Developments today in the case of the so-called Bayshore rapist. Attorneys for Lewis Harris asked to be removed from the case today, citing legal differences with Harris, who represented himself at his criminal trial 13 years ago. Today, 10 Tampa Bay's Eric Glasser was in a Hillsborough County court with an update on what happened. Well, the details of what had Lewis Harris's attorneys asking to step aside from this case are still under wraps, but they made it clear that they've had conversations and written correspondences with Harris and enough legal conflict stemming from those discussions to step aside. Harris asked the judge not to allow them to do that. The so-called Bayshore rapist who was convicted of posing as a police officer, kidnapping and then raping a woman along Bayshore Boulevard, represented himself at his criminal trial and has been doing so again as he seeks a new trial. They made commitments to myself and this court about things that they were going to uh, conduct in my case. <clears throat> Um, I hold them to those commitments. I would hope that the court holds them to those commitments as well. After a brief hearing, Judge Michelle Sisko agreed with Harris, finding insufficient reason, at least at this point, for his pro bono lawyers to withdraw from defending him. But she said if conflicts continued, she would allow them to refile their motion. Today was also the day that the court appointed investigator was supposed to report back about whether they were able to locate any traffic or weather camera video from 13 years ago. Images that an anonymous tipster who claims to formally be with the Tampa Police Department said would support Harris's case and his quest for a new trial. But apparently disagreements in that part of the case also have led to a delay with Harris now requesting his own investigator instead. In Tampa, Eric Lasser, 10 Tampa Bay. Harris claims Tampa police and prosecutors withheld video evidence that should have been shared with the jury in his original case. An appeals court has ruled there are enough questions about that evidence to warrant what's called a post-conviction relief hearing. And his next court date is August 22nd. Buying